Prince Harry arrives at Heathrow Airport less than 24 hours after arriving in the UK to see King. Prince Harry is on his way back to California to reunite with his wife, Meghan Markle, and their children after a quick trip to the UK. Welcome to Royal Pancakes. Please don't forget to subscribe and click the notifications bell, so you don't miss anything about the British royal family. Prince Harry arrived at London's Heathrow Airport less than 24 hours after flying from Los Angeles to meet his father after he was diagnosed with cancer. He arrived in the United Kingdom on Tuesday afternoon, without Meghan Markle and their children, less than 24 hours after Buckingham Palace announced the King's health. It is understood that Harry wanted to come straight to London after hearing of his father's diagnosis, but waited until the palace announced the news. He then jumped on a plane at LAX on Monday evening, after waiting for the news to break at 6 p.m., and was photographed arriving at London Heathrow Airport at around 2 p.m. on Tuesday. The two black SUVs, which were seen leaving the Windsor VIP suite at Heathrow Airport, were then photographed arriving at Clarence House, the King's London residence, at 2.42 p.m. Harry then met his father for the first time since the coronation in May. It is understood they spoke for about 45 minutes. Palace officials did not provide any details afterward about the content of their private meeting. It is believed the King kept the details to himself, but their reunion has raised the hopes of friends and family hoping they can find a way to mend the rift between them. I thought it was cause for optimism, one of the insiders said, noting the length of time they spent talking. King Charles then took an helicopter to Sandringham, which was delayed so the couple could chat to his wife, Queen Camilla. It is believed that Harry stayed in a luxury London hotel and not in an official royal residence. He no longer has a base in the UK because he had to return the keys to Frogmore Cottage last year. Royal expert Marilyn Koenig said of the air visit, that tells me this was not a successful visit in terms of being able to spend more time with his father. That's sad. Next week, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex will head to Canada to begin the official one-year countdown to the 2025 Invictus Games. The Vancouver Whistler Games will mark the first winter sporting event in Invictus Games history. Harry and Meghan will head north from February the 14th to the 16th, where they will join members of the participating country's winter training camp.